So I wanted to show you guys this. I had something that I built for this gravity flyer. Here's the gravity flyer here. We have this big motor right here. Now some of you said that's not traditional. It's not what Alexi had in the beginning. And I listen. So here we go. Here's another top plate. It goes right here, right where the other one was. I put the files on Thingiverse so you have them. Also, here's a PC fan, 60 millimeters right here, as you can see. What did I do? I basically built this piece that goes on here, and well, it's pretty much stuck right now. It goes on here and spins. Now that's just the motor spinning. You can see it has a little wobble. Not something I did. Motor designer built it, not me. So. I built a cap that goes on top of this. You cut out the blades, you take a piece of sandpaper, you go around there and sand off the rest of the blades. You do not need to remove the plastic. You leave it on there. There's a metal piece underneath that's the top. It takes twice as long to get to, ultimately unimportant in what we're doing, so I left it on. I built the cap so it's tight. It stays on there. I built the holes in it to be the exact same way if you built the gravity flyer on the last video it'll actually have the same bolt patterns on top here for these ones and it'll have the same bolt pattern that goes into this piece right here so now you get exactly what Alexi had has all the parts in it it's easy it allows everything to be attached Anyway, I hope this helps you guys out. Again, the files will be on my Thingiverse. I'll go ahead and leave a link in the description. Have fun with it, guys. Thank you. Here are the exact motors that I used here. They're on Amazon. I'll go ahead and leave a link in the description. I put a couple extra pictures in here so that you can see exactly what we're looking at. Again, we got it all connected together. Then when you take it apart, these little hockey puck looking things here. On one side it's flat so it can go on the disc. On the other side we created a hole in it so that it goes over top of where the flam page came off of. And as you can see it works pretty good. Here's all the different other pictures here. But we're doing good on this. It'll work for you. It'll get it in there pretty clean. Pretty easy to print off. Uh, real simple. If you like what you saw here today, please like, share, and subscribe. Thank you very much, and have a great day.